Hi everyone. So this is a cool sound I created in Massive, which I used in my most recent queue. It has quite a lot of flexibility in that there are many macros being used to modulate various parameters. Uh, and controlling the envelopes also plays a, a big part in the flexibility of this sound. Here's what it sounds like, and then I'll show you how to make the sound from scratch. For the most part, there's only one oscillator being used, and it's a sine square wave. A big part of the sci-fi aspect of this sound comes from the phase modulation, which produces the same sound as frequency modulation. The amount knob follows the envelope 100%, which creates cool movements in this sound. Add more voices and then pitch shift them for a thicker sound. Spread out the voices over the stereo field for a wider sound. I'm using a scream filter, which is a, essentially a low pass filter with uh, internal feedback. The internal feedback is controlled by the scream parameter. Macro 2 alters the sine square wave mix. Macro 3 changes the pitch. I thought 20 semitones was high enough, but that, that number can be whatever you like it to be. And these next four macros are used to control the envelope in various ways. So you have the sustain, the attack level, attack speed, and the decay. Next I use LFO5 to modulate the frequency cutoff to create a gated or stutter effect. The macro also modulates the amplitude of the LFO, so you can decide whether or not you want this effect on or off. Oh, my God. 
I do add a second oscillator here for another layer, but for the most part I usually leave it turned off. The filter cutoff just adds another level of control over the sound, which I thought sounded pretty cool in combination with the gated effect. I add a bit of chorus and flanger in the FX section. And finally, a bit of EQ to control the bottom end a little better. So that's more or less the sound. I've assigned each macro to my MIDI controller to show you what kind of sounds are possible. I also like to have more control uh, where I automate the macros with envelopes and Reaper. So thanks for watching, and if you're interested in the patch, I've put a link in the description for you to download. Bye for now.